Yes, of course it does. And the drive for commercial skills is in itself being driven by the need for associations to be more commercial to deliver their business to increase housing supply. So it's, it's going to be a consequence definitely of it. But I think the danger is that, for example, an organisation might think we're possibly not too strong in the financing area, so perhaps we'll recruit a non-executive to help us through with that. And I think that's not the right approach. I think the, the role of the independent board member is much more strategic and the danger is that you would rely too heavily upon that non-executive board member when it really should be something for the organisation to be dealing with at executive level. But yes, it's absolutely right, the dynamics of the business are changing and I think it's something that's going to have to be addressed by boards to make sure that whatever they do, no matter how commercial they're being, selling multi-million properties, for example, disposing of assets that they thought they would never dispose of, they are absolutely clear and united in that the reason that they're doing for it is for their social purpose. And this is something that needs to be cascaded right through the organisation as well. It's a cultural matter and boards must be alive to this. And it's to do with the way board members are recruited, their induction, and it's to do with their ongoing training and development, which is something that should be addressed. It should be not something that's left for, say, once a year, perhaps something that can be done on a regular basis to be factored in. It doesn't need to be formal, but it needs to be a way of making sure that skills are kept up to date, that board members are given the necessary information to make the best possible decision for the organisation. So yes, it's exciting times, it's very different, but I don't think the two are necessarily going to be a conflict. It's managing the culture, making sure the support's there, making sure the training and development programme is there for them.